Hello YouTube, and welcome to the sixth episode of Ants of the Internet. I'm your host, King Chris, and joining me today is our new guest, Lady Hayes. Hi. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm fine, you ready to answer some questions? Yes, I'm so excited. Alright, let's get to it. Alright, so question one. Would you rather have no music for the rest of your life, or have all music be sung by your significant other? Oh my god. Assuming you have um, one. Yeah, right? Okay. Um, this is hard. Yeah. Because they probably suck at singing, yeah. you know? So, like, as much as I love them, I feel... Oh wait, would you rather have no music? Okay, well then that's a lot easier. I guess I'd rather have them sing it because I would not want no music, you know? And does that mean that you have to be with them or are they, like, capable of making, like, you know, music videos or, like, you know, like... I keep thinking CDs or are cassettes, you... but, like, we're not back in those days, so... I know, but that sounds great, though, but... Like, it says your significant other. So, yeah. like, most people's significant other, like, as much as I love them, they don't sing that great. Yeah, they don't have musical talent. Or just yeah, they don't. They have don't. A good voice. But I'd rather that than, than no nothing. music. I mean, yeah, that'd, that'd be crazy. That's a weird question. If No, because I think it's a little messed up because, like, all music is sung by your significant other, so you can't sing for yourself. Like, you are incapable or you can't, like, think of a song in your head without them being the one singing it. It's kind of hmm. impossible unless everyone's memories get wiped except for that one person's, you know, your significant yeah, sure, others. That's kind of true, right? But it just says song. It doesn't say, like, you don't know music, right? I would hate to not have music for the rest of my life, but if, I, if I've been, like, brainwashed or if my memory's been erased or whatever and i can't sing songs on my own or whatever then what kind of what kind of music is that like you know to be limited to, to that like is it even worth it at that point yeah no i mean yeah and like i definitely would rather have somebody sing it than not know anything that's what it's implying that's you yeah because it's like you know or you have what oh you would you rather have no music or how the person sang it, like, I'd rather know music than not know it, mm. if that makes sense. I mean, for me, though, like, I, I mean, I love music, yeah, but I used to listen to music a lot more, like, back in my high school days. Ooh, that sounds so old. Uh, I feel like that's everybody's thing. That's what I feel like. But, like, now I just use my time for other things, so... Uh, if you know i don't listen to music as much as i used to so i could probably go without it wait you I don't, you say I don't that know. now but like if you didn't have it you would notice it like music is so much like part like a part of everyday life like yes but at, again at the same time like i said like if you've been brainwashed or whatever like if your memories have been erased I, are you brainwashed that's what right it now? seems like like how else do, is music just gone you know oh, well, from your head, except for I that person. I don't know. Person's. It just says, "Would you rather?" That's, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. at that point, it doesn't say you were brainwashed. At that point, like, it's like you don't miss what you don't know about. You know. I mean, I guess, but it doesn't say that though. Okay. Well, that's just like, is there a before or is there not? Like, did you know music before it? And this happened? Well, or... I, everyone has, Did you like, not know anything? You and, and I happened. have known music up until this point. I know, so... but you're trying to tell me that what if you were brainwashed and you never knew it before, so what's the difference? Yeah, that's, that's what, what I'm saying. You were saying. That that's what, what I'm saying. Like, at that's that what point, I'm saying. So, no music but it is better. Doesn't say that. But it doesn't say that, though. I don't know. I would rather somebody sing it to me if I knew music beforehand, yes. I mean, I, I guess, I guess I'd say that too, because maybe she'll know, like, like, it's not going to all sound good, but maybe there's a couple songs where she can sing it really well, and then it's worth. So? So, fine, sure. Fine, yes. <laughs> okay. Continue. Moving on, question number two. 
If you could play one video game for the rest of your life, I what would should... it be? Or which would it be? Um, mm. I that's don't... really hard. That's a really hard question. Yeah. Um, shit. <laughs> I know what Jay would say. <laughs> what? Oh. Say one video game. I'm pretty um, sure he'd say Dead by Daylight, but I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, it's like so hard because like I love a ton of games. Um, I feel like I wouldn't even pick Dead by Daylight nah. as much as I play it. I feel like I am gonna go for like a farming type game because oh it's like I know, but I feel like you can make it some like I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna go for Stardew Valley. Gonna, gonna go for on the what? Switch. Stardew Valley on the Switch. This is actually Have you played tough. it before? No, I haven't. It's a really hard question. Oh, you know what? Or... Yeah, this is really hard. Mm. Why'd you pick this one? This is ridiculous. I didn't, no, <laughs> I don't pick them. I randomly draw No, them. I know. It's like random, but... Yeah. It's a hard question. Yeah, because so there's you... so many that I would like play. I've played so many games over the years, you know, like well, not so many, but like enough where this is like a difficult question to answer. Like, yeah, exactly. You know, just one game, like, eh. like I you know, because I've been playing since I was like five, and like I love. Sorry. Uh, no, you're good. Eventually, you get bored of that one game, so either you play something else or you do something else, you know? So. Yeah, exactly. So I'm like, I don't know what I would pick. Like, <clears throat> That's a really hard question. Mm. I only said Stardew Valley because I feel like like it's like a farming whatever. I'll have to later. But look it up later. It's, and it's like pixelated, whatever. It's like looks old school, whatever. But it's like fun on the Switch or if you're on the PC, whatever, you know. But, um, damn, I don't know. Uh, I don't know either. I, yeah, like, I wouldn't. The other game I'm thinking of is basically a dead game, so there's no point in for me. Like, oh yeah, I just want to play that. It's like any game yeah. you pick will eventually become a dead game, you know. Whatever. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, that's um, hard. I'd probably go with some. I wish you could just pick like a game type, like a like a brand, like Ca Call of Duty games. Right. Because like, there's so much in the branch of Call of Duty, but no, it's one video game. So. Yeah. Like. Or like a genre, like an. Uh, like MMO or an RPG or something, you know. Like I could do that, but yeah. this is like too um, specific. I hate how some people can just answer so easily, and I'm over here like, oh, it wasn't an easy answer for me. Like I was, I'm so not sure about my answer, but I feel like it's such a, like you can do like whatever and stuff you can get married and build your house and like have a farm and stuff like it takes a long time also to get there so i feel like that's why i picked it because you can like drag it out for so long and like do all these different things and it's such like a cute simple game but it's also really complicated so it keeps me busy you just described minecraft so i'm gonna go with that <laughs> No, not Minecraft. <laughs> yeah, because like with Minecraft, you can do just about uh, anything. The possibilities are endless. I guess. All right, so that, if that's your pick, that's your pick. Sure. All right, Minecraft. Moving on. That's not my pick, though. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make that that's known. Not bad. All right. <laughs> 50, just... <laughs> uh, number three. Which group is worse? A, the people who clap during a movie, or B, the people who clap when the airplane lands? 62% of Barcel readers chose B. I, I, I don't understand why it's a bad thing to clap when an airplane lands. I also don't understand why people would clap when an airplane lands unless there, there was like a hostage situation and whatever shit happened up in the air and then the airplane finally lands safely and everybody's happy and then they clap like, woo! And like, other than that, I don't know why people would clap when an airplane lands. That's what I'm saying. Like, that part B had, like, made no sense. Why is that part of the question? So I'm just gonna. I've, 
I've never seen that. Like people yeah. clapping when an airplane lands. And then 62% of people voted for that. That doesn't even make sense. Well. I've I, never seen that. Do you think? Or like, is that a thing? Is clapping during a movie really a thing? <laughs> like, I, I get at the end of a movie. So. Like, if you're in the movie theater, like, it was so good. I've you must seen applaud. that. Yeah, I've seen that. I've seen that. Have you seen people in the middle of a movie clapping? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I haven't. Have you- Neither of these. Why is this a question? I don't. I don't know. I feel like it's a really bad question. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's 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 kind of a boring really, question, in my opinion. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with B. Make, I'm gonna go with A. You know what? Yeah, it's not really bad to go. To, oh wait, to, um, which group is worse? Yeah. I'm gonna go with B. No, I'm going with B then, because that doesn't even make sense. Well, I've never then again, that. like I would hate it if someone like started clapping oh, when I'm trying during to, like, a movie. Yeah. <laughs> So, because I yeah, don't care, right. I don't care if people start clapping when an airplane lands, I'm just going to go with A. I mean, sorry, no. So, wait, no, no. Yeah, A, yeah. No, sorry. yeah, you go with A. Yeah, because it's worse. And <laughs> How <laughs> dare you is... clap when yeah. I'm trying to, like, watch this, like. That makes sense, though. That makes sense. <laughs> well, then, well, I don't know. Maybe it's, like, an emotional moment in the movie and everybody claps i don't know but if if there's just like I've one jag that, off that's clapping like bro just stop <laughs> there's a guy in the corner just fucking clapping <laughs> all, all right, right yeah should we that's just move on <laughs> yeah go on. go on 54 would you ra- would you rather fuck the <laughs> hottest girl celebrity who has a dick or vin diesel with a pussy should we change this for you like like a hottest guy with a vagina or I don't even know. I don't know how this Hold would on. work for you. Let me let me look at this question again. Hold on. I mean, I guess you could still fu- fuck the hottest girl with a dick because you you don't have one. Right. Yeah. Like. So that would have... make more sense. Unless it's you want like unless you want to scissor right, with on. Vin Diesel. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Do I or do I not? Or, like... I mean, there's always <laughs> the strap on thing. I don't know. Whatever you want. Oh my god. Okay. Wait. Would you rather fuck the hottest girl celebrity with a dick or Vin Diesel with a pussy? Oh my god. Okay, wait. Okay, I don't even, <laughs> I don't even know how to answer this question. <laughs> uh, if you want, I could go first for those one of those rare times where I, I would go first. Um. Well, I was like trying to flip it, but then I was like, who would Vin Diesel be? Yeah. You know. Like and I was instead. like. Uh, yeah, like what about changing it around? What about Rachel Ray? I don't know. Uh, that's just the first. Oh, because that's a female. Martha, Martha Stewart. Mean? Well, yeah, you gotta flip it like Martha Stewart with a dick. Oh, right, right, right. Duh. Okay, wait. So then it would be <laughs> fuck the hottest guy with a pussy or Rachel Ray. That's not on the same level as Vin Diesel. What do you what mean? The, I said Martha Stewart afterwards. That's not even. <laughs> I don't on know. On the same level as Vin Diesel? Who is on the oh. same level as Vin Diesel then? Um. Damn. Okay, I don't even know. Are you, are, are you sexually attracted to Vin Diesel? Like, would you do him? Like, normally. With a pussy? No, normally. Oh, not really. Normally. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't cry about it. Like... <laughs> I wouldn't cry about it. <laughs> You'd probably brag to people like, yeah, you, you know Vin Diesel? I fucked him. Yeah, I mean, like, why not? But... Right. Okay, yeah, so we'll just keep it the same, and I'm just going to go with Vin Diesel with a pussy. You'd have fun with that? Just... Okay. Yeah, I would just do it, yeah. Like, how, would you, you? how would you do it? We need details. I mean, like, we would have to, like, scissor or something, I guess, right? Strap like, whatever. Ons, that seems more fun, though. What, scissoring or strap on? I feel like. Like the strap on thing. I feel like Vin Diesel would have the strap on on him, though. Right. Of course. Right. I feel like he would. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. Maybe like, would he, wouldn't he feel bad that he doesn't have his usual package? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I, like maybe. <laughs> even if even if he has a pussy, I wouldn't want to fuck him. I'm I'm okay with and okay. I have never done anal with a girl. So, but that's what I would do. I would fuck the hottest girl and it would just be anal. I don't care if she has a dick. I'm not fucking Vin Diesel instead. Uh, (laughs) So, we'll just do anal or 
she'll just blow me, whatever happens. Like, I'm not going near that dick, and I'm sorry. Uh, I don't know, because I'm not like, I, I don't know, maybe I'll jerk her off. I, I, don't, I don't think that's me, though. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have any intentions of being fucked by a dick ever. Hmm. Well, it didn't say you had to be fucked by a dick. No, it says, would you rather fuck the hottest girl? So, like... Who has a dick. Right. It doesn't say you had to be fucked by a dick. Hottest girl that... celebrity as well. Like... Is it really a girl at that point if, if she has a dick? Isn't isn't the genitalia what I constitutes mean, the gender? That's politics. That's politics. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's my answer. I'm not fucking Vin Diesel if he has a pussy. Like, well, yeah, I, why would I, you I'm not, Vin Diesel? I'm not, into, right. I'm not into bald guys. Maybe if he had a blonde wig or something. Oh, man. I feel like we need to skip this question. <laughs> <laughs> We've went into so much shit, though. Alright, we'll move on. 55, <laughs> or number 5, whatever. If you won $300 million, what are the first things you would buy? Worded, I hate really. these questions. Mm. This is worse yeah, than the previous one. Yeah. Because uh, I don't even know. Um, That's a lot of money. Yeah, like what would I buy? You'd buy a vagina for Vin Diesel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, right. Um, Mine's going to be like really generic, I feel like. I mean probably the same for me. I mean, like, I buy my parents a house. Duh. You'd buy your parents like, a house? Yeah. That's number one. What do they live in Two. now? I mean, they live in a house. But, like, I'd buy them a house that they don't have to pay for anymore. You know? What What about you? Well, that would be number two. What, a house for yourself? Uh, yeah. Okay. And number three. Number two. Three, I feel like I would want to buy something crazy. Like, mm. hmm. <laughs> like something ridiculous. <laughs> um, like? Like my own, like my own humpback whale. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> like, oh, I'm about yeah, Texas. <laughs> <laughs> That's that's not my number one. I was like saying that's your third crazy thing. No, I know, right? <laughs> no, yeah, but like, what if I just bought a whale? Like, why not? Buy a whale, name it Becky. No, because <laughs> then I'd have to kill it. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I would not. Poor like imaginary Becky. whale. Right. right. Is that is that your final? Like, that's your three <laughs> things, or like you're changing Wait, anything? Wait, oh, whale at the end. Parent. So number one is parents' house. Uh, par- parent, buy a house for your parents. Number two is a house for yourself, and number three is a humpback whale. <laughs> Where do you, are you gonna put this whale? Because you don't have an aquarium. <laughs> you didn't, that wasn't one or two. I know, shot. Like, what? What if it can be like one thing? Like, I'm buying a whale with an aquarium. I guess. Like. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> I would probably. I mean, yeah, I'd buy a house that's, you know, still relatively affordable, like, with barely any help from the 300 million, like, or whatever's left over, that is. Because, like, I still... Three would... things, though. It's still three things. It's basically saying 100 million per three. Well, so. not necessarily. Because what well, if... I guess, but you can't say you're what if I want to buy a, buy a candy bar? House. What if I want to buy a candy bar? You know, like, what if that's just in the... I'm the, that's like the number mood I'm two. In. No, but what if that's like, that's where I am? Like I just won the lottery um, ticket, or I mean I just won the lottery. And I'm like, anyway. Yeah, but you can anyway. only buy three things after no. you win. So no. why would you buy? No, it's, one? that's not what it's saying. It says yeah, it is. The, if no. you won three hundred million, what are the first? Uh. Jeez. <laughs> Okay, don't buy a candy bar, though. Come on. I'm not. I was just saying, like, what if that's <laughs> what happens, you know? Like, that's the situation that's presented itself. That, you shouldn't do that. Do you want to change your third answer? Because apparently you thought differently. No, I don't think differently. I still want the whale. Okay. I'm not so changing anyway, my answer. House. Yeah. 
house, car, better PC. <laughs> That's me. I, I need to get a, a nice car and a better PC for myself. All right. That's reasonable. Yeah, I'm going to be that guy. Anyway, uh, moving on. Yeah. That's like an adult answer. Oh my god, I'm so mad. Would you have oh, sex man. with a dead person go. for five minutes if you'd get your laundry done and folded magically for the rest of your life? 52% of Barcel readers said no. That means 48% of people said yes to this. <laughs> uh, go okay. Ahead. Okay, this let's just okay. let's just assume that the person you're fucking, if you do it, is remaining erect. I mean, unless you want to be, a, what's, it, what's it called, pegging or whatever? Unless you want to do that for whatever reason. Okay, what is that? You don't know what pegging is? No. <laughs> it's when a girl fucks a guy with a strap on. Oh, okay, yeah, I did not know that. <laughs> Alright, continue. You're the one answering first. Oh, okay. Well, Continue. that's what I tried to do, and you come out. Okay. Wow. So, would you rather have sex with a dead person? Blah, blah, blah. Five minutes. Okay. Why did so many people say yes? Well, more people said no than yes. Yeah, barely, though. Like, barely. Let's yeah. not play around. Like, this is almost even. <laughs> I mean, like, I have a ton of laundry that needs to be folded and put away, but, like. No, it just says A dead person? Oh, like, done. Ew. Done and folded, yeah. Yeah. Well, what if they just died? I mean, I guess it doesn't say that, but. Yeah, then it, yeah, it didn't say that, but I, I would just assume, like. But just died? Mm. Even then, it's weird. Yeah, I so yeah, I can't do that because you know, like they start to smell like right away. Do they? You ever drive? Yeah, you ever right drive away? by like? Yeah, you drive by like a dead animal before. You know how bad that smells? Like imagine like a human body, like. Well, hum humans, How bad that would smell. Humans tend to keep themselves cleaner, so I don't. No, uh, but so organs and stuff that are like it's, I don't think it's exploding. right away. It's not right away. Yeah, you start to smell. Yeah, you ever kill an animal while you're driving? No. Well, okay, that's different. Yeah. You're running it you over. Are, you're expo listen. You're exposing yeah. its insides. Who it's not the same. This? Okay, who says this person? Then I get run over, and they're just no dead, one, and no one's fucking up. Why? Like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Why? That's. No, that is so okay. Just just imagine like what you tell the police. Like, yeah, I, I ran him over, and then I this genie showed up and was like, "Hey, if you fuck him for five minutes, you know, you can, I'll fold your laundry magically." <laughs> That's and what I'm saying exactly. So fucking like, that makes up no sense. Yeah. <laughs> and this is why I imagine it, like you're in the middle of doing it with the other person, and then they die. In the no, middle of doing it. That is not Do how you they keep mean going? It. Do you keep going for five more minutes? <laughs> before <laughs> do you keep to going? Down? I mean, do you know they died? Or you just Yeah. Let's say You yeah. know they died. Well maybe for okay, like the that's... first minute you don't realize and then they're like <laughs> not saying anything and in a weird position you're like, Are you okay? <laughs> no response. <laughs> I feel like this is like really fucked up. Like <laughs> It really is. I'm still waiting for your answers. Um, yeah, I'm saying no. Like, I'm I'm yeah. not gonna do that. Like, I'd rather fold my own laundry. But it's just for five minutes. Think of all the time that you could save. Dude, like, do you not know? doing the, your laundry anymore. <laughs> and you could we do whatever know. else. Okay, so you're telling me, if you're in the middle of fucking No, 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 somebody, we're still talking about you. We're, still, we're still talking about no. you. I I'm just trying to see if I can answer. convince you. <laughs> no, I don't know. That's just good. I can't. That's too much. That's too much. <laughs> See, I'm thinking about this, like, with lack of emotion, I'm trying to, for a bit. And, uh, no. You, you know? can't. It's so bad. It's, it's just so bad. five minutes, and then no more having to do laundry for the rest of your life. I'm 21, okay? That's a lot of laundry. And I all that you. time, like, I all that time adds up. So, like, that's going to be, like, years worth of time saved because I spent five minutes fucking a dead girl. Like, 
Yeah, but like, how fucked would you be in your head the rest yeah, of your life? Though, like, like, that's not worth it. That's no, ew, no. Is it? Is Please. it like? Why are you entertaining it's, it's this? It's not. It's not it's rape. Okay, so. It's not rape because it's not okay. Why? Because she's dead. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Is it, is it some random girl that I just met at the bar or off the street? Because then, yeah, it's a little weird. But if I've known this person... I mean, it's it's weird either way. It's fucking it's necrophilia. It's even more weird that you're saying, like, oh, yeah, I know this person now, and they died, and now I fucked them five minutes longer after they died. Like, that sounds so weird to me. I can't. I don't, I don't know. Like, trust me, this this idea is gross, but I'm thinking about it. Like, it could save years off your life. I mean, it could. Like, did you but even think about that, that before I but said is that? It no. worth it? But is it worth it? Like, it's not worth that. Yeah. No. Ew. Girl, skeptic, we need to move on. <laughs> I still need to give my answer. I've just been oh, yeah. thinking out loud here for the purpose of entertainment for the viewers. They're yeah, probably shaking bad, their but... heads and face palming at me. Yeah. I'm um, telling him to move on, I swear. This is a bad question. <laughs> I can't with this I guess, one. I guess I'll say no. I probably couldn't bring myself to keep going. It would just be too weird. I'll say no. I won't. I won't okay. fuck a dead girl, people. It's fine. I'm just saying. Oh, uh, uh, what a guy. <laughs> 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 what, a, what a guy. <laughs> what a guy. Would he's you, not available, oh, but he's a guy. Would, would you rather live in a world with only girls or a world with only guys, but you couldn't jerk off? So for you, it'd be opposite. So if you're with, if you choose only girls, then you can't masturbate. And if I choose only guys, then I can't jerk off. Anyway, so okay. Do you see what I mean? No, I'm trying to reword it. Like, I don't get it. Okay, wait. So, basically, do you live with your gender, but you can't masturbate, or do you live with the only the other gender, but you know you can do whatever, obviously, but you can never like talk to another female ever again because you're the only female there and whatever other stuff. <laughs> well, I don't care about that. Then yeah, I guess I'd rather live with like a world of guys, right? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, you gotta choose between the two. So it's not all about sex, right? Because you can only do that so much. So, mm -hmm. uh, would you really want to live with just guys all around the world, or just girls? Hmm. <laughs> like, if you pick just girls, then you'll never see me again, or hear—I mean, hear from me again, or whatever. I mean, like, is that so bad? That'll be so devastating. Like, is that so are, bad? Wow, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, like, it's so, so bad. Damn, hard truth. <laughs> right? Like, you'll no um, more, no more answer the internet episodes. Like, <laughs> oh shit, who am I gonna beg? Okay, um, but like, basically, uh, it's saying like, if you can't masturbate, then the only way you can get yourself off is to basically turn gay. Unless you or, just, or just be celibate, you know, girls can. I mean, I guess that. I'd rather be the other way. Mm. Like then, I guess I'd rather our girls, right? Maybe. I mean, it's not all about that, but I mean. No, it's not. But I mean, it's part of life. If you were the <laughs> only girl, that would be mm -hmm. like problematic. <laughs> Yeah, feel, right. <laughs> like, all I the guys like, would want to jump on you. It would be so, yeah, so bad. Yeah, I feel like I'd be really wor like tired. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Tir tired from running away, right? Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. From running away. Yep. <laughs> Just always on the but run. But I feel like I'd be really, like, lucrative, you know? Like, I'd have a lot of money. <laughs> oh, so you're, <laughs> you're not just giving it away. No, fuck, you gotta make money off of it, shit. Right? If like that's the, what the case is, like, I'd richest, rather make money of it. The richest girl on the planet. Well, Because I'd be the person. only girl, right? I meant richest person. Uh, oh, okay. 
Yeah, if I was my only girl, then yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, for me, <laughs> I'd probably pick only girls. Just just because I wouldn't want to, I would not be able to live with just guys. It would just be, we, we, we'd all die eventually. At least sure. I could just like go around the globe and just like, I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't even know if the fucking female race would even want to do it with me, but. I mean, I mean, if you were the only guy, they'd have to. Um, I mean, unless, I mean, not really. They could just accept the fact that the human race is done for. There could be. I mean, they could, but like there's that. always gonna be like that one, like thirsty bitch. Wow, that one. <laughs> that okay. one thirsty bitch. You're good. Yeah, no, I mean, I'm not really like I'm not really worried about that, but that's obviously like, the first thing that comes to mind. <laughs> I'm not worried like, about that. But you get, yeah, you get to. Right. Fuck everybody on the planet, but not really, because everybody yeah. has their own opinions. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, so yeah, only girls because I wouldn't want to live in a world with just guys and not be able to jerk off, and you know that be my life. Uh, so plus, like it, it, I feel like it'd be like it'd be horrible during Shark Week, but besides that, it would be during pretty what Shark Week? Shark Week. Why? What do you mean with Shark Week? P period week, basically. The, the time of the month. <laughs> oh. Huh? I thought, it was, I thought it was something totally different. I thought you meant like Shark Week like on Discovery Channel. No. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> it would be like a living hell. But besides yeah, that, it'd be, be kind of, it'd be kind of interesting just living with the female perspective or whatever. Women's rights will finally be a thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, be, I'm kidding. Uh, yeah. Anyway. So anyway, yeah, that, move that's, on. That's my answer. Moving on. <laughs> 58. <clears throat> Which fictional character would you love to beat the shit out of? Hmm. Fictional character. Damn. I almost wanted to say Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> wow. Why? <laughs> yeah, I don't even know why, but, like, he just popped up in my head, like, he's just, like, such a bitch sometimes. Oh, sorry. He's just, like, such a jerk sometimes. You can say bitch, it's fine. No, I know. All right. But that's what I thought of, but that's not my answer. Okay. okay. Good. Um... Fictional character. Probably Harry Potter. Why? I just hate the whole thing. So you're going to beat up Harry? Yeah. Why not? I'd like an explanation. I just don't like the whole series. I don't... I mean, like, it's good. Like, I've watched the movie. Or I read some of it. I watched movies. But, yeah. like... I, I feel like he's so... He's so, like, overdone. Like, I just want to punch him in his fucking face. Wow. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, I like, used to, I just don't like him. I used to I love it don't... as a kid. But then, like, I grew up and, you know, I, I rewatched it, like, once or whatever. And I was like, oh, wow. They're just, like, waving sticks at each other and stuff comes out. That's that's funny. Or yeah. Whatever. You, you know, know like, what? It's probably it's so really... Fake. I mean, it is fake, and every, like, movie and everything like that is fake, so maybe I feel like I'm being too, like, harsh yeah, on Yeah, I feel like you are, honestly. <laughs> yeah, I feel like, like you're being, like, really mean about it, but, like, for some reason, I always hate Harry Potter, but I'm not gonna lie that I've watched all of, like, okay, I didn't read the books, but I watched the movies, and I was, like, into it, you know? So, I feel like I'm being, like, a jerk. I'm like, oh, let's fucking beat up <coughs> Harry Potter. <laughs> yeah, I... Okay, well, if that's your answer, I'll go ahead with mine. Uh, I've seen a lot of movies, so it's kind of hard to narrow down to one. But one does come to mind. Uh, Count Olaf. You know, Olaf! Just because of, like, the shit he's... Tried Wait, to pull Count Olaf. From what do you mean? The series of unfortunate events. 
Never seen that? That's a good one. No, I did. You did? That's good. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Good answer? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you know something? I changed my answer. You know if I... Um, the principal from Matilda? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's a I hate... One. Oh, man. Yeah, I love to punch her. Or beat the shit yeah, out of her. Yeah, I was about to say, it's not just Sorry. punch. Yeah, no, beat the shit out of her. Yeah. I love... I hate her. Yeah. She just made me so scared whenever I watched the movie. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> yeah, all right. Moving on. <sighs> 59. Is a hangover worse on Saturday or Sunday? 75% of Arsenal readers said Sunday. I, mm. I, I. It doesn't really matter. It's just a day. Like, it depends on when you have work the next day. Yeah, you know? exactly. Like, for me, I'm going to say Sunday, though, because that's, like, worse for me. So I'm going to go with Sunday. Why is it worse? I have, like, two days of work in between. So, like, if I... Like, I have to go back, like, early Sunday morning. So, like, if I'm hungover, it's, like, not fun. A hangover is a hangover either way. So, yeah, it just depends. Like, for me, I don't always have the same I mean, I don't off really from... get a hangover, though. Yeah, me but... either. Because I don't drink that much. Or I, have... I can't remember the last time I drank. But for me, with my job... I don't, you know, my work days are not always the same, and neither are my days off, so um, it, it would really depend, uh, so that's why I can't really say either way, like, I don't, like, like I said, a hangover is a hangover, so whether I pick Saturday or Sunday, I'm still going to feel like shit, uh, so unless you gave me, like, an example of when I'd be working or not, or when I need to do something important or not, I can't pick a day, so that's my answer. Yeah, I guess it's good. Um, yeah. All right. This is the last one. Last one for now for this episode. Mary Fuck Kill, a Jehovah's Witness, a clown, or a street performer dressed like the Statue oh my of Liberty. God, dude. You don't even know. <laughs> what do you mean? What do I not know? Like, I, I. No, I have, like, so much stuff behind this question. Mm. Pray tell. Like, I can't, I can't right now, but, um, I can't even believe you picked, like, this question for me. It's I so did crazy. not pick them, okay? <laughs> no, no, I know, like, it just came up, like, it's so yeah. ironic, it's so ironic for me. Uh, like, do you right have, now. like, a bad history with a Jehovah's Witness or a clown or something? Or a yeah, straight I performer do. that's dressed like a Statue of Liberty? <laughs> no, I, no, I totally do, and it's, like, that's... bugging me out right now. So I'm specific. Like, um, like you just yeah, like, all just... of them are specific, and, like, I do have a relation to one of them, and it's, like, bugging me out right now. You just want to kill all of them? Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I would, um, I'd fuck a street performer, okay? Mm-hmm. And then I marry A and kill B. Or kill A. The other A. Why are they all A's? Wait. That, no, it, that's not like, it's just saying a Jehovah's Witness, a clown, or a street performer. Oh, I thought they were, <laughs> like, where's A, B, and C? I was like, the fuck me up. Okay. There was no A, B, and C on the card. No, it's okay. Okay, I so, definitely kill a street performer. What do you mean? Didn't you say you'd marry the street performer? No! He's always been knocked out. Like, nah, nah, nah. You, I could have sworn you just said you'd marry them. Mm. Or fuck them or something. Anyway, sorry. No, um, I don't think I did. I don't think I did. I thought you did. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't, though. <laughs> Go ahead. It's your answer. I don't even know. This is so hard for me. Oh, my God. <laughs> let's, this, let's just say it's not the same people that you know from before. You know, it's three random. All right, thank you. Yeah, yeah like, you're right. This whole time, like, <laughs> you just have no, to assume it had no, to be those people. No, because this one is like, it's like really weird to me. All right. Um. Okay, so we kill the street performer. Okay. Uh. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, fuck the witness, and then marry the clown. Really? No, but 
I'm like, that really, like, fucked up my head. Really, like, too much. I... But yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Is that your... So you're going to kill the street performer, marry the clown, and and uh, fuck the witness? Oh, wait. Let me... Wait, can I change it? Yeah, you can. All right, kill the witness. Oh I'm going to fuck the clown, <laughs> oh and then I'm going to marry the street performer, okay? Okay, is that your final answer? Yep. Okay. So, I would marry the street performer, kill the clown, and fuck the witness. Here's why. So, I'm not against the profession as clowns go. I'm, I'm not a fan of clowns. I don't really like clowns. and I But I understand that some people do it because they need the money. But I just find it creepy. So, I could not... I would not want to marry a clown. And I don't really want to fuck a clown either, because this is too weird for me. So I guess I have to yeah, kill him. Yeah, right. So that's checked off, killing that person. Uh, fucking the Jehovah's Witness, like, I'm not a religious person. So I don't want anything to do with that. That's why I'm not marrying them. So I'd rather fuck one, because then it's like, oh, I'm just fucking a girl in, like, this this slutty Jehovah's Witness's outfit, you know, whatever. Make it, like, a, a, like a weird... Uh, like a schoolgirl thing or something, even though it's like a, a Jehovah's Witness outfit, whatever that's supposed to yeah, look like. Yeah, like, I can't, I can't even go into that, but yeah. What do you mean, you can't go into that? No, because you're doing it that, I can't. But yeah, that's like weird, so. Well, I might as well make a thing of it if you have to go through with it. No, I can't. It's like a whole okay. thing. Well, anyway, and then marry the street performer because... That sounds like the most normal thing out of these three to right? me. Right, like all I like out like, of three of them. That sounds most normal. Which yeah, is like, sad. it's not like that's gonna be their job for the rest of their life. So they'll they're right now they're a street performer. But I'll be like, all right, well, eventually you're gonna do something else, right? Like, and you don't exactly. marry someone based on their profession like solely, so it's not too big of a deal. Yeah, anyway. <sighs> that's what I'm saying. But yeah, so yeah, I said kill clown, marry street performer, and fuck the witness. And you said, what'd you say? You didn't you say you'd marry the clown? No wait. Which one? No. You, what'd you say? Wait, can I change it? I don't remember <laughs> what you said. Go ahead. Okay, so good. I'm changing it. I'm gonna say I marry a street performer. Oh fuck the witness. Oh no, wait. Fuck the clown and kill the witness. You just must have some bad experiences with some witnesses. I do. Okay. Well, that was the last question, so that concludes <laughs> episode six. Uh, this was fun, and uh, we'll see you in the next episode for questions 61 through 70. Okay. Bye. Bye.